Now, scientists say they have found a new way to prevent patients from catching the hospital superbug, MRSA. By wearing these, they are special pyjamas. Yes, they've got a, it's a silver thread. You, think you can just see it there running through the fabric, and the makers say this neutralizes the virus. Some campaigners, though, claim they're a bit of a gimmick and say the only way really to tackle MRSA is by making hospitals cleaner. Well, Neil Mansa formed the National Concern for Healthcare Infections after his dad. Bob died of MRSA. Matthew Hart works with manufacturers to create silver-based products to fight the disease. Good morning to you both. Good morning. Um, Neil, yes. what happened with your dad? Unfortunately, my father went into hospital to have his diabetes stabilized. He stopped his toe, and unfortunately, the infection got into his toe. He had part of his foot amputated. Um, unfortunately, the infection didn't go away. Nine months later, the other foot became infected. Um, that became a lot worse, and uh, basically his foot became detached from his leg, mm. which meant he was walking on the bottom of his uh, leg. Um, unfortunately, last year he went in for uh, an operation to have that rectified, and due to complications, he died. Uh, this time last year, literally here today. Mm. So, and as a result, you've taken it. Uh, a, a great interest in, in the effects of MRSA. Matthew, just I wonder if you could explain for us the, the principle of the silver. Right, well silver is, has been used as a, a, a natural antimicrobial for, for centuries. Um, more recently it's actually used very effectively in things like catheters and wound dressings which are actually clinically shown to, to reduce infection So how does it work in, it work in terms It basically of stops bacteria from being able to reproduce. So when a, when a single bacteria cell, it stops that bacteria from being able to be able to, to double up and, and keep growing and then become an issue. And if you put it in pyjamas, does that help? Well, the technology behind it is very, very sound. As I said, with certain products, there, there is good clinical evidence behind it. Um, actually, there's a company, Bioco, that have put silver in environmental products, and that's been shown to reduce bacteria by 96%. Environmental in, in products like? Like door handles, um, uh, curtains, hospital beds, things like that. Mm. Um, I haven't actually seen the data behind the, the pyjamas themselves. Um, but you but, think the principle is... The principle right, of silver's, silver's there is, is sound, but uh, you know, we're looking at a, 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 com a complete right. approach to infection control. Well, Neil, what do you think of this? How much are they? 45 pounds? Mm. 45 pounds worth of soap. That's what, what probably is better for you. Keep, wash your hands when you're in hospitals. And make sure everybody that comes near you washes their hands. Don't rely on the alcohol gels. Wash your hands because you, MRSA is one of the bugs. C. difficile and all those other bugs out there, that has no effect on it. You know, so it won't affect uh, a number of the other bugs out there. And Matthew's right, silver has a great place as an antimicrobial, but 45 pounds, wash your hands, keep the environment clean. Are you suggesting then that, that things like these pyjamas with silver in them, they're simply distractions, that we're not getting the basic point, which yes. is keeping our hands clean when we go exactly. into hospital? It, that's exactly right, and uh, it has to be stressed. It's not only healthcare professionals that have to wash their hands, it's you and I. And when we walk into a hospital, the first thing that we should be looking around for is a sink to wash our hands and then use the alcohol gel so that we right. are protecting of our loved ones. Matthew, you're not here to endorse the product, but to explain the science behind it, but I mean, is, is this, you know, does it help as a as it sort of protective? I don't think on a technical point of view it, it can hinder. And I, and I think we need to do everything we can to reduce uh, or help reduce infections within hospitals, whether it's washing your hands. I totally agree with Neil on the washing your hands, the hand hygiene. And uh, I personally believe there's extra technical products that can be used within the hospital, such as silver in the environment, that can assist and act as a, a system behind the general cleaning and hand washing to, to, to help hospitals try okay. and keep themselves But you have clean. a worry with that in the fact that people are going to believe they're protected from an MRSA. They're going to stop thinking that they have to wash their hands. They're going to have to stop thinking about right. personal hygiene. And that's and the basic yeah. me message you want to send. Make sure. Okay. Neil Manser and Matthew Hart, thank you both very much for joining okay. us. Thank you. Good to talk to you.